Well met, Hunter. I should be training. You need to go? No, I'm just not the kind of person who takes a lot of breaks. If you never rest, you will never recover. Yeah, I know. Muscles don't get thicker if you work them every day. But if I'm not training, I'll lose my edge. A guy named Blade is worried about losing his edge? Shut up. And you're the third person to tell me that, so don't look so impressed. We should do this again. Man, I just wish I could have brought my brother Gabe along. He'd love this place. Charlie. <laughs> what is it, Charlie? Find something? must not be her purview. There is my ferocious Charlie girl.
Something smells... pungent. That would be Grandma Stark's famous linguine and clam sauce. With some Tony adjustments. Grandma's recipe was not good enough? Well, I loved her to pieces, but she also loved vodka in her cooking, and I can't touch the stuff. Not anymore. I even made sure the Abbey has a dry bar. What did I do to deserve this honor? That's just my way of saying thank you for being one of the only Midnight Suns who hasn't threatened to banish me to the Netherworld, empty my jugular, or portal me to the sun. And that was just today. I apologize on behalf of the other sons. Oh, it's not all of them. Oddly enough, the guy who turns into the flaming skull-faced demon is a real sweetheart. Just like you, Hunter. Thanks. Still, the others could be more hospitable. Eh, as Pepper says, I am definitely an acquired taste. As is the garlic in Grandma Stark's famous sauce. Ah, you two would have really hit it off. Like you, she had a heart of gold, but could be quite the demon when crossed. Used to frighten the crap out of Dad. I thought it gave her character. Know who else I'm pretty sure has character? Who? You. Bon appetit, Hunter. Hi. Tony Stark used to be the ultra-rich jerk I saw on TV. Now, he's the ultra-rich jerk... So, how's the whole saving the world thing going? You're welcome, Hunter. If this thing behind me turns into a giant gateway to ancient Egypt, I'm quitting.
fascinating. Lucky day, huh? Let's do it. Time's wasting, Hunter. Haha, <laughs> nothing's gonna stop me now. I think we've got something. I would be rotting inside that creature's gullet if not for Spider-Man. Time to return the favor. We'll find him. We're running facial recognition on every surveillance camera in the cloud. Oh, they just keep moving too fast. Uh, can't believe I'm saying this, but you think Team Spooky's doing any better? Nothing. Well, your inflection on that last dactyl was... perfect. Perhaps a magnetism rune? Against a level 5 demon-alien hybrid? Where did you learn your magic? Demo Khan? You know... You really do have a look. Hunter's right. This isn't working. On to plan C. Well, more like D. Norman won't mind if I borrow a few Oscorp satellites at 45,000 feet, right? Higher, further, faster, baby. 82nd and 5th. Well, between 5th and Madison now. Guys, they're live. And they're trendy. Hashtag Big Alien Apple. Not bad. Thanks. Now imagine if you had just asked for our help sooner. No time for an after-school special. Hatching it through. Hatching it all through. We need to hurry. on the way. We can charge in, but what do we do with the creature? If we catch Venom, we should dump him on a desert island, or the moon. Venomous 
taken to the rooftops, and he's tossing just about anything he can find onto the streets below. There are innocent people down there. Get them to safety before it's too late. have tennis elbow or something by now? We just pull our scumbones and bring them home to mother! Subdue this animal and bring it to site one. We'll squish your face, burning your... Consider switching occupations if I were you, friend. I know, I know, no job's perfect. But at the end of the day, it's all about the co workers. come by and visit the old neighborhood. I'd say let's all stop for a group selfie, but Eddie might get a little jealous. I cannot fathom why one of my mother's followers is so obsessed with this. I'm not sure what any of that means, but Eddie and I were doing our thing here in New York way before those horns grew out of his head. I've never known him to pick on civilians. I need to get these people out of his way. Just like old times. No mercy, servants of the Hail. Just give it up already. How about we hit up that Chinese buffet over in Bushwick? My treat! All the food we need is right in front of us. Lilith must not have left instructions for Hydra on how to control her new pet. Can't say I feel sorry for them, but there's still civilians trapped here, too. Oh, cool. I can hear her, too, talking in my head. It's a comm system, the same one I activated in your suit. Right, that was gonna be my next guess.
Well, that's exciting. I have freed one of the civilians. I've been waiting for this. You will have to do better than that. If we're lucky, that creature will run out of things to throw. Better yet, let's make sure he has no one to throw at. Gotta get these people to safety. Awesome. Making your presence known. Try harder next time. Thankfully, Venom's attention seems to be focused on the outside of the museum. The people inside should be safe for now. Careful! He might be able to hear us! I think I saw him swallow a radio tower on the way over here! Just the boost I needed! Everybody gets one! Civilians are clear. It's open season on Hydra and their pet monstrosity. They will be the next to fall in the hunt. Wow. You two ever work with a guy named Craven? like that once, centuries ago.
chance to hone those skills of yours. Don't leave any Hydra standing. Keep an eye on that one. Too weak for this fight. We've got them all. Now let's get to Venom and stop all this. No more games. No more running. You can't stop us. Try and help you, Eddie? Help us. Help us! You took everything from us, Spider-Man! And now, we will take your world! I'm gonna put that down as a definite maybe. No time to lick our wounds! Spider-Man's lead here. He's the expert when it comes to Venom. Um, thanks. I recommend giving him a wide berth. Especially if he's feeling huggy. Must be strong. 
stronger than it looks. Otherwise, you're in trouble. Here we go again. Nice move. When to quit? My fine heroes, embrace mother's love. Your struggles are pointless, and they spoil the meat. Is he always like this? Personally, Eddie always gets extra grumpy when he's hungry. Think he's bad? You should see Jameson if he doesn't get his morning bagel. Fight soon before he brings down the entire city. We will make you pay for that. This one's for you. I do feel pretty amazing. Oh, 
sorry, Eddie. I think you're just picking up a whiff of garlic from DiCarlo's. Tell you what, call off this ending the world thing, and lunch is on me. I'm just following orders. Mistake twice. Victory, everyone. from all of New York to you, our slobbiest invaders since Thanos. Even I need a moment to myself occasionally. Run along now.
I can tell you trained with master hunters. Many thanks. <laughs> Yo, it's good to see you. You too, Hunter. Kept people safe, preserved works of art. We need to know the nature of Faustus's research. So, you've been dead? Yes. What's on the other side? Of death? Yes, blazing trumpets, fiery pits, Thor's backyard. Where did you end up? The barking was endless. Wagging tails stretched to the horizon. But after my death, I learned that all dogs really do go to... I'm going to stop you right there, boss. See if Corgius was not on my afterlife bingo card. Uh, I have a betting pool going on which religion was, you know, right. I was really hoping you could give me an edge. I guess you will have to figure it out for yourself. Well, let's hope that's in many, many years. There has to be a next time. Let's do it soon, boss. Hunter. Curious. To see how the patient is faring? I assure you, Hunter, his injuries are minor given the circumstances, and he's convalescing quite nicely. Do Don't call me that, Eddie. I'm, uh, I'm Spider Man. MJ. MJ's boyfriend. Sometimes. <laughs> 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 
It's complicated. I'm watching the way you handle yourself out there, Hunter. You're not bad. I was thinking maybe it's time you and I compare moves. Moves? As in combat? More like a friendly competition. A friendly competition, you say? Well, recently resurrected teammate competition has less of a ring to it. The feeling is mutual, Blade. How about we just fight already? Before we begin, is there anything else I should know? Yeah, anything goes. Just don't touch the shades. Now you want to say it or me? Say what? Ding ding. Spider-Man would probably appreciate it if you looked in on him. I think he's quite impressed by you. Aha! Yet another victory for the hunter. Damn it! You totally ambushed me with that pair of queens. I have to admit, I didn't think you'd be such a formidable poker player. Yet another reason to respect you. It is just beginner's luck. I am sure your next hand will vanquish me. There you go again, being all unexpectedly humble and generous. You're a hard demon to dislike, Hunter. Even if you are beating my butt at Hold'em. You do not dislike me, Captain? Don't get too excited. I didn't say I liked you either, but you've got potential. Deal another hand then? I'm all in.
Most people only know me as the billionaire industrialist who occasionally saves the world at great personal risk and expense. In reality, I'm actually a very down to guy. Hey, can I ask a favor? Thanks, Hunter. Hey, look who's awake! back to me as soon as you can. You'll be the first I call. Something amiss, Captain? Nope, nothing. Just Bruce being Bruce. More importantly, really glad we got Spider-Man back, Hunter. Not sure if you've noticed it, but these end-of-day scenarios really tend to put a damper on morale. It's nice to get a solid win, you know? Every victory we have inches us closer to stopping Lilith, and every life we save is another ally against her. In this case, a wisecracking radioactive Spider-Man ally. Which is a good thing, now that we know Hydra has been augmenting their soldiers with this radioactive green gamma shampoo. We're gonna need all the help we can get. Speaking of helping, should probably get back to it. There's a certain special Hydra mad scientist out there whose face is just begging for a smacking. And these gamma signatures of his don't seem to want to analyze themselves. Talk to you later. Emo kids for life. What? You want to know who am I? Who am I? <clears throat> I am the web-slinging arachnid of justice. I am the fearsome spider who just ruined your day. Wait, and wait, wait. Who, who owns the night? I am the eight-legged bringer of justice. I am Spider-Man. 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 Spider-Man? Oh, hey, Hunter. Didn't see you there. Everything's fine. This is completely normal. All the top heroes do it, I'm sure. Do what? Practice their hero voice. In my case, my spider voice. I figured if I was going to be teaming up with this group, I ought to up my game. Sound more, I don't know, Scary, I guess.
I do not think you need to change a thing, including your voice. Easy for you to say. You ooze demon hunter coolness. I'm just some guy in some spider-themed tights. It was not I who drove off the venom creature. You are a powerful demon hunter in your own right. You really think so? I know so. I actually came here to thank you. Thank me? For what? And by the way, does this thanks also involve pizza? I have to say battling Eddie always works up the appetite. If I were to acquire this pizza, who would I give it to? Your identity remains a mystery to us all. Oh, you want to meet the spider man beneath the mask. Sorry, that's a no-go. My true identity is a closely guarded secret. Not even MJ or Aunt May know for... Wait... I see what you're doing there. Sorry, Hunter, the mask's gotta stay on. I hope that's not gonna make things weird between us. The Abbey is a place of many secrets. Your identity is safe within these walls. It's not the walls here I'm worried about. It's out there in the real world where the people I love are. No mask can hide you or them from Lilith. Her gaze can pierce your very soul. Yeesh. Reminds me of my best friend's dad. And that was before he became a flying goblin. I know this is not easy for you, Spider-Man. The people here are very different from one another. They do not always see eye to eye. But one thing I can say in truth is that I trust them with my very life. Lives. Wait, did you just say lives as in plural? Yes. I am really gonna enjoy getting to know you, Hunter. And we would enjoy getting to know you. The real you. Listen, let me think it over, alright? It's a big decision. Gotta meditate on it. Check my horoscope, roll it around in my head, and maybe we'll talk soon. Cool? Cool. I really need to think this over. Even a sorcerer's caretaker could have at least back again. This will make a difference. I could not have predicted this outcome, but it is intriguing. Got more coil for me? This will never get... How does this look? can we work on for you? Until next time.
What's up? I needed that. First we crawl, then we stumble. Hi, hi, Hunter. Better to have it and not need it, right? Ready to work? Not everyone wants my advice. Hunter stalks its prey. I've probably built at least 50 Iron Man suits to varying degrees of completion. There's really no end to the combinations I can come up with. Hey. What's good? 